Hey the music friends and welcome back for another reaction and analysis video. We've listened to several songs off of this new Polyphia album, but today we're going to be listening to Chimera, which features Lil West. I can't wait to hear this. All oh, their music is fantastic and I'm pretty excited because they're coming to Pittsburgh in April and I've got tickets. That's going to be pretty awesome. Don't forget to leave me your thoughts on this music today down in the comments section. Oh man, I got to go back just a little bit here. What a great opening with Tim Henson playing that little little flamenco-y kind of thing that he's doing there on that uh, acoustic guitar. And then Scott LePage with this ripping, low, gritty, dirty um, melody that he's playing. And Clay Eichelman on the drums. Man, he just had such a a feel that he just ripped off there. I went back, I'm hoping I'm, I went back far enough so we could hear that. That was, this opening was pretty sick. <laughs> Bill again. I like this bass line that Clay Gober's laying down too. That's pretty funky, pretty funky. We just heard another awesome fill by Clay Eshelman, the drummer. I backed it up so we could hear that too. The, these guys are just some of the best musicians and the, the, the creative things that they think up to do on their instruments and, and just try to figure out a way to blend it all together. Man, that's mind blowing what they can do. It blows me away. I'm going to back up so we can we can just kind of look at Tim Henson's fingers. All these guys are the same way. You know, normally when you're playing on that fretboard, you want to keep your fingers as close as possible. And that way that can help you to increase the speed that you have when you're playing your notes because the distance equals time. The farther you pull them up, the slower you're going to be. But not them. Uh, they're just so incredible and their reflexes are just so quick. You see their fingers can come up farther, but they're just as quick. They, they, they get to everything so fast. Look at that. Wow. Oh, that bass is so sick. Finger tapping there by Scott LePage.
these images are are interesting. They actually go along with the music very well. Good girl in a costume. It's your world when I'm with you. Forever with you like a tattoo. I paint a picture in a bad mood. Shoot for the breeze like a parachute. I got cheese, get a pair of shoes. Big body need a lot of room. She keep calling when I'm never home. I'll be what you need, low key on the ease. I can see everything that you went through. I'll be your tool like a big shoe. Even if I lose, it'd be nothing new. Oh, that was pretty cool. This little West is pretty good. I like I like what he's rapping there. I went back because what little West was kind of singing and rhyming there. Clay Eichelman was playing on the cymbal. So he was doing that rhythmic part there. Check that out. I'll be what you need, low key on the ease. I can see everything that you went through. I'll be your That's pretty cool. Like fix you. Even if I lose, it'd be nothing new. She don't lose when I work school. It's my rules when I make moves. I make it rain like a monsoon. My new break can you come soon. That side was the best ride. She said that she really want to come out to the west side. If she come with me, she can hit me with her face. She can be my missus, give me kisses on her best side. Low key with me in the night. Oh, the harmony on that between Henson and Page is cool. I did not expect us just to kind of stop. I'm going to back up just a little bit here. So I mentioned about the harmony that we kind of had going on there. We kind of had that little duet between Tim and Scott. And they're kind of playing very similar melody. And the notes are just a little bit different, creating that little bit of thickness, that harmony. And I keep saying it, Clay Gober on the bass, man. His, his bass line that he was dropping through this whole song was just so cool. Check this uh, little duet part out here. That sounds very, very cool. Look at those fingers go. Like spiders on the fretboard, man. Those fingers are just all over. Well, I thought that song was pretty awesome. You know, when you hear it's Polyphia, you know you're going to get some mind-blowing things in that video. And we always get that. We always get these really difficult rhythms. We always get these pinch harmonics. We always get these just incredible, how did they even do that kind of things? It's to the point where if you check on YouTube, you'll see people trying to do what they do. Sometimes they do it just as good or better, and they, they kind of blow these guys' minds because they watch videos of these people doing this. But, you know, it's just so incredible, the things in the rhythmic, difficult, complex patterns that they do on all of their instruments, not just Clay Eichelman on the drums, but it's Tim Henson on the guitar, and it's Scott LePage on the guitar, and it's Clay Gober on the bass guitar. They're always putting these envelope-pushing rhythmic things in with all the hard melodic things that they do, which makes their music just completely unique and so interesting. I, I, they just blow my mind all of the time. I can't wait to go see their show and see them do this stuff live because I can't picture how some of this is going to work, but I, I hear they can do it live, which is mind-blowing. If you enjoyed this video today and you want to watch another one, just click on a video you see on your screen and keep watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider hitting the like button and consider subscribing to my channel for future content. This community is so awesome with all of these music suggestions. I found new groups. You'll probably find some new groups too to listen to. And they're always spectacular. I've, I haven't been suggested anything that was bad. It's just all been so amazing. Don't forget to check out the description down below. There's lots of links down there. Links down there for more reaction videos from Polyphia, more reaction videos from other artists. And there's also a link down there for my favorite music store. That's where I got my headphones. These are Audio Technicas. 
The bass on these is so incredible. If you want to hear groups like Polyphia on some great headphones, check out the link down below and get yourself some of these headphones. Don't forget to leave me your thoughts on this music today down in the comments section and feel free to make a suggestion for a future video. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time.